You're expecting a man in speedos driving a Ferrari Testarossa to come roaring past at any second. <laughs> Good evening and welcome to tonight's episode of A Beer With Bob, titled You Must Be Pablo Escobar. Yes, and tonight we are going to be tasting a beer from the Mr. B Brewery in, wait for it, Bologna in Italy. We have gone into Italy here, the epicentre of the coronavirus, to taste and get there. Bamba New England IPA. Look at that. Bamba New England IPA. Yes, indeed. Now, what is a New England IPA? What is a New England IPA? It is an American style IPA with a more fruity, tropical taste to it. Very heavy on the hops. It's a smoother, sweeter style of beer, so suited more to that American palate. You know, hints of sweetness on most of the taste buds. Uh, Mr. B, this can is an attractive can. It's actually got modelling on it. Uh, Don Pablo himself. Don Pablo, obviously, Pablo Escobar. And they say this is a beer that would have been made... Almost as if how Don Pablo himself would have wanted it to be. Obviously, he was a uh, a big, big uh, New England IPA drinker. Uh, it is a beautiful can, very colourful, beautiful art history on there. Almost Tom Selleck there, Tom Selleck in Magnum. So anyway, enough about you're expecting a man in Speedos driving a Ferrari Testarossa to come roaring past at any second. The can... Uh, let's open it up. This beer is 6.3% ABV. It is pokey. It is going back to being like that Ferrari, Ferrari Testarossa. It's going to roar away when we open this. But let's crack the can. Oh, it's starting to fizz there. A bit lively straight away. Oh, as you can see, there's that white head just oozing from the top. But let's pour the beer. I remember the golden rule, a beer with no head is dead. Let's give it a good pour. You know, get a good head on this beer. We really want to get a nice head on the beer. It's naturally going to have it. There's some good levels of carbonation in there. Lots of little bubbles pouring. Okay, so a really thick, white, creamy head. You're going to get that round your nose. So, you know, Pablo Escobar, you're going to get a nose covered in white stuff when you're drinking this. You know, looking at it, it's got a thick head. You know, looking at two fingers there with the head, I've got quite sausagey fingers, so that's quite a thick two fingers there. The beer itself is hazy, traditional of a New England IPA, hazy, yellowing texture. Uh, it is murky-ish, but let's get it around the nostrils. Okay, the nose, man, it's, it's sweet. It's tropical, there's sweet mangoes and peaches, nectarines and... Hmm, do I detect a hint of quince? Yes, indeed, it's quince jam there. So let's, with no further ado, move on to the taste. That's what we're here for. Well, it's medium bodied. It's very easy to drink, actually. Pineapples, tanginess, yeast appearing on the back of the palate there. Yeah, it, it's almost like you're eating a sandwich. And in that sandwich, you've got the yeastiness of the bread with pineapples and peaches within the sandwich. Mango as well. They're all dancing around the mouth and you've used a little bit more marmite in there for a little hint of malt. Just a small, small hint of malt. Let's give it another taste. You can tell by this I'm quite enjoying it. Yeah, they're dancing around the mouth. It, You can almost say it's like an alcoholic lilt. That's probably a good way of describing it. It's an alcoholic lilt with minus the grapefruit, 
with the addition of 6.3% ABV. Wow, that's pokey. Dangerous beer at 6.3. It's really nice. Bamba, New England IPA. You can get this from Beer 52. That's where I've got it from. Uh, it's a bit pricey at £3.49 for 330 mils. But for a beer of this quality, I think it's well, well worth it. I'm going to say that the Bamba New England IPA from Mr. B in Italy is the best thing to come out of Italy since the coronavirus. Four Bob beer. This is a four Bob beer. Anyway, enjoy yourself. Stay safe. Stay indoors. And keep drinking. <laughs>